The morning sun gave an indication of what was to come. Temperatures in southern New Hampshire expected to reach into the upper 80s or low 90s with heavy humidity. It comes just as many students are returning to school. We know that, that in the heat, that our students and our staff will struggle. Some of the buildings in the Concord School District are older, so steps are being taken in an attempt to cool things down. We had folks come in uh, last night, open windows, get all that nice cool air into the buildings to help us. There is also concern when it comes to exercising, particularly outdoors. We ask the kids to dress lightly. Uh, we've limited outside recess uh, to you know not, not have the kids out in the hot sun playing. And the heat advisory comes just as they're trying to get students settled into a routine. We just started the year off in trying to get a pattern of learning and, and consecutive days in. So. We'll see how it goes and uh, we will monitor it for the next three days. Today is also opening day for the Everett Ice Arena. The compressor's running hotter because of the weather. Inside, they were testing the ice depth. The arena manager says in weather like this, it's tough to add to that depth. Fortunately, we got ours in um, in time just before this heat wave hit, so we're up real close to where we want to be for ice steps. And in a sign of things to come, the Zamboni was also out, making sure the skaters will have the best surface possible, even in the face of this heat. We've just learned that another sporting event has been postponed. The Concord soccer games that were scheduled against Nashua have been rescheduled for October. Reporting live in Concord, Ray Brewer, WMUR News 9.